It's getting dark outside. It's nighttime already. Ah, <sighs> that felt fast. Ever since I arrived at this island, a day passed by abnormally fast. The doorbell? Does that mean someone's here? For me? I, ca I cautiously walked around the door and opened it slowly. Wary of, might be on the other, or wary of what might be on the other side. Probably somebody with a knife. Nice to have met oh, ya. God. Nice to have met you. Wait, what? That don't make sense, girl. You crazy. <laughs> uh, it's past tense of nice to meet you. You know, since we already exchanged nice to meet yous. Ibuki, what the fuck do you want? That's totally Allow me to apologize for surprising you with my sudden visit. <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, it's a lot better than last time when you broke into my room. <laughs> <laughs> Ta-da. You must be the type who holds grudges. My ears or joint hurts. What? Oh, my ears and joints hurt. You know what? There's a part of me that thinks that the fact that she broke the lock on my door is probably going to play an important role in the future. Right? That means you have gout? Gout? What the fuck is that word? So what do you want? Um, um Ibuki doesn't get it either, but it looks like an invitation was sent to everyone. Ah, fucking motive. Yes! See? This thing. What the? It's totally a girl's writing. Let's see, recovery party for Fuyuhiko at Titty Typhoon at 9 p.m. Oh. Ibuki, you made this? Because it seems like your whole entire color scheme is on this card. And it looks like you probably want to play music. What is this? Is this Monokuma's doing again? Why? How rude! Don't put that in the same category as Monokuma. It's your doing? I, I, I don't know what you're talking about at all. Ibuki just just bought the invitation. It's definitely her. <laughs> well then, Ibuki has some preparations, so I'll go on ahead. I'll leave it to you. <sighs> she even said preparations. She's completely behind this. Huh, Teddy Typhoon. Is it I'm still surprised no one has ever remarked on the name of this fucking place. I'm surprised no one looked at that sign and said, hmm. I'm just gonna hang out at Teddy for a little bitty. You know what I'm talking about? Anyways. Uh, it's the music venue on, uh, music venue? Music venue on 3rd Street. 3rd Island. My bad, not 3rd Street. What the fuck is wrong with me? 9pm? That's in like 30 minutes. But even though it's pr it's a party for Fuyuhiko's recovery, is he even gonna be able to come? After all, he just slid his stomach like a fucking idiot. But, she took the uh, trouble of doing this out of goodwill. I guess I should hear the music or whatever. Fucking... I should hang out! See what's going on. Speaking about hanging out and seeing what's going on, what the fuck? Are you alive? You're good? Okay, you know what? Here, I haven't gave you a present at all. Here's some water. You like water? That's cool, it has a hope meter. You know what? If one present just fills hope meter, let's just give it a bunch of junk that I probably won't need. Make a pet with nothing but hope. Gave you all the hope in the world. Gave you a. Uh, let's see. What we got here? Miku's. Oh, God. Uh. Don't know what this is for. Angel's fruit. What the hell? There. Man, look at all that hope you have. It's crazy hope. Uh, three stars. Dragon Blade. Uh. Wooden stick. Oh, Monomi's things. Uh, and your fruit. Sure, let's go with this skull shit. Maybe that'll give it to spare. It's a skull after all. Nope, has hope. I don't think I'll need the tissues anymore. 
give it two more presents and I'm done taking care of you. Until until you like evolve or whatever the fuck. Uh cake. Got some wine. Flash pressure. I don't know who the fuck would want this. And uh What the fuck? I don't know what the fuck. Here you go. There you go. Now you're full of nothing but hope. What's your name? Snake of me? Snake me? I don't know. There you go. You'll feel you'll feel better. You're a fellow of nothing but hope now. Time to head to the titty typhoon. This is where the murder is going to take place. Didn't I say this earlier that the murder was probably going to take place here? Aw, oh, why is he invited? Come on, last time we invited him to a party, two people got fucking killed. Oh, why are you here? What do you want? Now I can tell you, Buki invited you too? Yeah. yeah, I'm honored, but since everyone else is going to be there celebrating for Hiko's recovery, no matter what, I think it's too rude for someone like me to go inside before everyone else arrives. Uh, you don't have to worry about me. You can go inside first. Believe me, I'm not worried. Hey Gundam, what's up? This too. Tonight's constellations heralds the bank uh the banquet that celebrates Fuhiko's resurrection. <laughs> How idealistic. It's nearly Now then, let us begin the ceremony of darkness. This guy. Ah oh, fucking who cares? Look at all the people who are going to be, I was about to say murdered, but I mean only one person's going to be murdered. Someone's missing already. There's two people missing already. Ibuki, which is understandable, she's the one throwing the party. And Hayako, I have not seen that bitch yet. Fihiko, why are you? What? Is it bad that I came? No, not that. Is it okay for you to move around? It's gonna be fine. Yeah, it's nothing. <laughs> There's no way you're okay. You're seriously injured. Even so. Uh, they took the time to throw a party for me. There's no way I wouldn't come. I understand how you feel, but you really shouldn't overwork yourself. I'm not overdoing it. Jeez. Fine then. Just let him do whatever he wants. What? But huh? it's fine. Just let him be. Apparently, Yakuza's have pain tolerance down to the art. I can't believe he's actually forced himself to join this kind of event. The old Fuyuhiko probably wouldn't have come no matter how much we invited him. He probably trying to do his very best to change. Hey. But it looks like uh, Hayako definitely didn't come. How that seems to be the case. Huh? Uh, Akane's not here to- You're right! I for fuck- I fucking forgot again! Mm. I'm so not worried about her. What- What is this wild woman off doing? I hope she's not planning to do anything strange. As if on cue, right when Nekamaru expressed his unease, that's when it happened. Eh? My. Oh my! Suddenly, the stage lit up very brightly, and the person who appeared was... Hey, y'all! It's Ibuki Miyota! Thanks for coming out today! My specialty is making beef stew! <laughs> I may not look like it, but people tell me that I'm a nurturing type. So I'm gonna do my very best performance so I can make everyone feel better! I hope you're all pumped up! As I thought. Ah, uh, that's what she was gonna for. Well, she is the ultimate musician after all. I can't imagine what else she'd do at a music venue. Alright! I'll start singing this first song with full-on energy! So, put your hands together! Since she was originally a member of a high school girl band that dominates the music charts, I can probably look forward to her musical stylings. What was the scream for? I can skip this. 
but I don't think I want to. I don't know how long this is going to go on for. Maybe I should skip it? Maybe I should skip it. I'll give it like one more minute. Hey, Bookie, I think we're done before I start getting copyrights. Thank you, everyone. Ah! What the fuck is wrong with his face? I'm gonna get cursed. What? Such an overwhelming ba baffle wrist sense. Even my four dark days of destruction look less lively than usual. Something like I this. I'm too starting to feel chills. Wait, with the title like from me to you, I thought it was going to be a sweet love song. If I recall, the reason why Ibuki left the high school girl band was creative differences. The most... That that must be why. The rope smoke. <laughs> Yahoo! It was awesome! That's the first time I ever uh, heard such a famous song. Hi Hayako? I'm glad. Oh, you came. So what if I did? I was invited to, you know. What? But if you're attending for Yahiko's recovery party, that means you've already... That's not it! Are you stupid? Don't misunderstand. There's no way I forgive him that easily. Hey! Because he's a Yakuza, you know? He's the type of person who preys on people by tricking them. Even now, he's probably just pretending to be sorry so he can just trick us again. Please wait! There's no way that's possible. I know. No, I get why she think of that. Huh. Yeah, that's right. That's why we're never going to believe in you. Get it? This doesn't mean we made up or anything. I'm only cooperating with you until we get off this island. Huh? Huh? So. Just remember, if anything happens, you're the first who's going to get cut off. Huh. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, I'm glad. I'm really, really glad. Ew, don't cry, pig. Pigs have no right to cry. You're grossing me out. I see. Fihiko's not the only one who's trying to change. Huh, she's also trying, huh? The old Hayako. There's no way she would ever forget Fihiko like this. Hey, what are you looking at? D nothing Somehow, even though it's a little by little, I feel like things are starting to turn around. But that's all the reason... That's all the more reason to worry about him. Yeah, Nagito. I'm looking at you with a corner of my eye. Monokuma. Oh. Yeah, I guess, Monokuma. There's no way he's not going to do anything while he's watching us like this. Boring. Yeah, how much longer are you guys going to be bummed out? I came all the way here because you said it was a party. Yay! Come on, Ibuki. Hurry up and start the next song. Roger. Thanks for waiting. Let's go right ahead. Huh? There's still more? Now that this recovery party is in full swing, I've got a ballad prepared that totally fits the mood. Grab a partner and slow dance too? I squeezed out the baby, but I have no idea who the father is. What the fuck is wrong with you? Stop it! <laughs> no more! <laughs> oh, it's over! Hey, what's everyone doing here? What? Monomi? Gee. Hey, don't interfere. Uh, I was just enjoying such a fun party, too. Uh, I wasn't invited to the party. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously not. You'd ruin the party if you were here. Uh, double gasp. Whoa. But seriously, now's not the time. Now's not the time to enjoy a fun party. Why? Uh, uh, Kane, Kane is... 
Kane's dueling monocle. What? What are you doing? What? What did you say? <laughs> At this point, Akane is going to be in danger. Please do something to save her. Mm -hmm. uh, looks like my bad feelings were correct. That stupid fool. No, I'm the one who's fool. It was my mistake to not keep my eyes on her. As a team manager, I should have proper... Eh. I should have I should have had a proper ga grasp of my athlete's private life. Damn it. This failure will haunt me for the rest of my life. Or my name is Anekimoru Nidai. Um... Now's not the time for regret. Let's make haste. Of course! Fihiko finally returned to us. The thought of anyone else in our group getting taken? I won't allow it. I'll never allow it. Hey, Minomi, where's Akane and Monokuma? Uh, they're at the beach where the first arrived at the island. Please hurry. If you don't, Akane's gonna get killed. You don't have to tell me. I'm going full speed ahead. See? And we should hurry, too. Uh, Nakamura bolted for the music, uh, from the music venue as fast as his tiny little baby legs could carry him. And we followed him soon after. I should hurry, too. Hey, everyone. I should hurry, but what do you want, Ibuki? Thanks. Thanks, everyone. No, that's not it. I know Akane's in deep trouble, but you guys suck. Screw that half-baked comfort. This is where a song title will be salt seeping into my broken heart. I don't really get it, but you look pretty bummed out. Come on, you shouldn't make a fuss here. Let's hurry over to the beach. She's right. I should hurry, too. Everyone should hurry. What the fuck are you doing, Akane? I, I literally just said I have nothing to worry about. She's the dumb one, right? Like, of course. Of course I have everything to possibly worry about. After running there at full sprint, by the time I got to the beach and struggling to regain my breath, I saw a shocking scene unfold before me. Akane! Looks like you're just barely avoiding any fatal injuries! Yep, at least your agility is worthy of praise! But did you only challenge me just so you could show me your sweet dance moves? D damn it! Well, why can't I even graze you with my attacks? Well, you know, we're on completely different levels. That means we view the world differently. It's like a character from a punk manga challenging an enemy from a super-powered battle manga. <laughs> it's obvious you can't win. Hey, hey. Is she really serious about not even gracing it? Akane is just a fighting stuff, she's fighting a stuffed animal. What the fuck? <laughs> Monokuma is an advanced machine. If it's designed for combat, it's probably capable of exerting such power. However, as far as the speed is concerned, Akane is far faster than any athlete that I've ever seen. And she says that she can't even graze him with her attacks? Is that even possible? <laughs> However, because it's possible, that's why she's in this situation, right? As long as she ended up like that, there's not much we can really do about it. At the very least, we should overcome the despair of Akane's death and use it to fuel the bolstering of our- SHUT UP! God damn it! Right? Like Fuyuhiko did, you see? Don't-, Don't <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna let him speak for himself. Damn it! I never wanna feel like that- I never wanna feel that feeling ever again. If I have to feel that way again, I'll make sure I stop it, even if it costs my life. Ah. No, you can't! You already die if you keep exerting yourself. <sighs> It's just a little life Pico gave me. It's not precious anyways. <laughs> you stupid idiot! There's all more reasons you need to take care of it! Huh? Don't stop me! You guys stay back. I'll take it from here. This is Nekomaru Nidai's final firework! Make sure you sear it into your eyes! Now then, it looks like everyone's here, so I might as well finish this! Didn't I say I won't allow any rule violations against me? This is what happens when you break the rules! Disappear! The world shook and turned stark white. As if the surrounding scenery and every sound was blowing away with uh, blown away by the impact. 
It was all completely white. And within the white, I heard a voice. Nekomaru, why did you s save? Piccolo, why did you save me? Why did you just push me out the way? Oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> Isn't it obvious? Supporting their athletes is a manager's duty. Is Nekomaru seriously gonna die now? Really? Is this how it happened? However, what a shame for someone like Nekomaru Nidai to... It was just a little shot from a bazooka. I really am the worst. <laughs> get a hold of yourself, Nekomaru! Akane, the time I've spent with you, it... It wasn't so bad. Are you ever going to tell me what it was? They never elaborated. Don't die, Akane. Nakamaru! Oh, homeboy got fucked up. Are you kidding me? Nakamura died? What, what? What? Holy crap! Instead of the rule violator Akane, what, what a major failure! I end up killing Nakamura, who had nothing to do with this. Hey! D the, hold on. It's faint, but his heart is still beating. It's not. He's not dead yet. Huh? Ooh, uh then you gotta hurry and treat him. Hey, Monokuma, you still do something about this, right? Save Nakamura's life like you saved me. Hey, hey. That's right. If you kill someone who didn't violate the rules, it makes you the worst. Uh, makes you the one who violated the rules. Well. Ah, uh, then let's just say we're even, huh? <laughs> In exchange for forgiving Akane for breaking the rules, let's just say Nakamura was the sacrifice. Yeah. So isn't it okay to say we're even? Hey. You, you're not gonna save him. Jeez, guess I have no choice. It's annoying, but it was... It's being born if he died a meaningless death. So, so, for today only, I'll activate my special trump card. And that's when it happened. The sirens started ringing out of nowhere, and it gradually became closer and closer. Ooh, uh, this again? Just leave the rest to me, Dr. Killgood! He even recycled the same line again. We gotta get this patient to the Monokuma Hospital ER and get him under 24 hour observation stat! So, I'll see you later! And after he said that, the ambulance containing Nekomaru. Uh, Monokuma and Nekomaru vanished from our sights. What the hell? Why did this happen? What's going on? Hey, he's gonna be alright, right? Nekomaru's gonna be saved, right? Of course, he's obviously going to be saved. But Fuyuhiko finally returned to us. Can't believe Nekamaru is gone. It's gone now. No. no more. I can't stand this no more. Hey, hey can you stop yelling? Screaming won't help you now. Because, because, this isn't because. This is what happens when we let our guard down. All this talk about everyone getting along. We were just fooling ourselves. <laughs> We were just pretending we understood the situation we're in. Teamwork, friendship, cooperation, nothing matters. The stupid one will just be killed one after another. It would be a mystery when you eventually betray. That's why I'm never going to rely on anyone. Uh, that's, that's the reality here. Uh, Are you saying it's meaningless for us to even work together? Shut up! If it really did have meaning, Nekomaru would have ended up like this. He ended up like this because of his weird feelings of friendship. You. Hey, you understand too, right? When the stupid ones try to act on their own, it makes trouble for everyone else. Hey! So can you please not involve me? I don't want to die a meaningless death. That is... D Tayako is blaming Akane will not solve anything. Huh. We don't have to worry about Coach Nekomaru. Huh? huh? Man, that's disappointing. It's all your fault and you're not even worried about him? Akane, you're not worried about Nekomaru? There's no need to worry about worrying. 
I know Coach Nakamaru is a monstrous guy. There's no way he's going to die from something like that. There's no doubt. Nakamaru is definitely going to come back. So, when that happens, I'll make sure I apologize to him. Because if I was too weak, I caused him trouble. So when he comes back, I'll make sure to say I'm sorry. Kane? As we all returned to our cottages, we were silent. Even if we opened our mouths, only words of worry could come out. We all knew that. When we saw Nakamura's uh, tragedy happening right in front of us, once again, we were all thought. If you think you won't die, well, that's just wishful thinking. On this island, without any warning, people die. That is the nightmare we're trapped in. When you think you've finally awoken f up from the nightmare, you realize you're still inside of it. And thus, the nightmare continues. Monokuma Super Fable Story 58 A Tengu Came Down From The Mountains A long time ago there was a village that was afraid of Tengu showing up. The Tengus apparently did as they pleased such as stealing food and kidnapping women. But is that really the Tengu's fault? Isn't it actually the humans fault for ruining nature by destroying the mountains where the Tengu lived? You think monsters are scary, it's humans that are the scary ones. Everyone, now's the time to raise up, <laughs> raise up, rise up against the humans. We must protect nature from the humans and return to the world to a peaceful place where monsters roam free. Bring it on! Monokuma Super Fables, the end. Ahem! Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. Good morning, everyone! Looks like today is going to be another perfect tropical day! Now then, let's show some enthusiasm and make sure to give it our all today! Huh. As usual, well, even if I said that, it doesn't matter anymore. But I greeted the morning without having slept at all. I really want to see somebody, anybody, as fast as I could. I felt like I had to share this anxious feeling with someone. I just couldn't deal with it alone. I should go to the restaurant for now. Yep, I keep pressing triangle from time to time, thinking that'll open the menu. That's weird. Time to save this game, because I haven't saved in a while. Alright, uh, let's see. Do I have more time to record? We are good on time, actually. Time to head to the restaurant. Do that real quick. Oh, you know what? Instead of teleporting there, let's walk there. Let's walk there. Say good morning to somebody. I don't know. Somebody special. Uh, let's see. Is anybody out here? Fujihiko. Let's go talk to Fujihiko. Hey, man. You're right. Yo. Oh. It's you, Hajime. Huh. Huh. Even in such an abnormal situation, people still get hungry. Nekamaro, what that bastard mean by his final firework? That line more suited to Yakuza, anyways. Nekamaro must have wanted to protect the Kani at all costs, just like how Pekka wanted to protect you. you. Shut up! Don't say another word. Sorry. Just go on ahead to the restaurant. I'll come later. Fihiko. Huh. Don't want to open up some old wounds, eh? Hey, time to say good morning, Chiki, like always, because she's always here. Good morning, Hajime. Yeah, morning. See? Being depressed won't help. Let's believe in Nekomaru. Come on, feel better. Yeah, that was a quick one. Hmm? As I was walking to the restaurant, I suddenly stopped. I heard the sound of a girl crying inside the restaurant. Someone crying inside? Mikan? Or is Hayako? I peeked inside and quietly walked up the restaurant. Walked up the restaurant? Walked into the restaurant. <laughs> I 
Huh? <laughs> Akane, you're the one who's crying? <laughs> I'm scared. What's gonna happen to us? <laughs> I'm scared. What happened? Could she be in shock about what happened to Nekamaru? But yesterday, she was acting braver. Uh... Hey. Nagito, you wanna tell me what the fuck's going on? And what happened to Kane? She's acting kinda weird. I see. Hajime, be careful. It's probably not the real Fuyuhiko. What? Huh? I know the real Fuyuhiko is already dead. That's why it's probably Fuyuhiko's clone. You... What are you saying to me? Hey. Also, I heard from Monokuma that Nakamura couldn't be saved. It's fortunate, but... Tra are, what is wrong with you? I think you're planning something. A transfer student is apparently going to come soon as replacement. <laughs> so, what's all good? The person a warm welcome. You, are you messing around? I'm not messing around. I always speak the truth. In order to prove it, I'll explain it especially to you. Listen carefully, Listen carefully Hajime. I finally discovered who the traitor is. <laughs> you know the traitor identity of World Ender? The traitor who was hiding amongst us? No Byakia. That's right, Byakia is alive. He's been weird from the start, but he's acting much weirder than usual. Okay, Hayako, you want to tell me what the fuck's going on here? Hey! Hey, it's definitely best if we keep Nagito tied up. D thank you! Thank you! Please! No, not just tied up. No! I won't be satisfied until I peel the skin off his face and expose the meat so we can <laughs> identify him even more. That doesn't sound very gentle. Did he do something to you? <laughs> that idiot, he lied to me about Mahiru being alive and he... And he said he saw her at the movie theater. Why is he telling such pointless lies? I don't know. I hate being lied to. Jeez. I won't feel satisfied until all those joints are bent in awkward angles. It's probably be a waste of time to find out the reason for each little thing Nagato does. I don't get it at all. Why do you have to tell such an outrageous lie? Alright, Kane, you alright, girl? <laughs> what, what happened to Kande? It's not like you to cry. Get a grip of yourself. <laughs> I don't know what to do anymore. I mean, Nakamura got killed, you know? What What are you saying? It's not like Nakamura's dead yet. I'm scared. Uh, I don't want to do this anymore. Let me go back home. She must be in shock that Nakamura sacrificed himself for her. Now nah, there's no way to explain the change of sudden dramatic. Pardon me, everyone, but you happen to have some time to spare. Hello, my name it is Ibuki Miyoda. Are you okay? Ibuki, you seem pretty different. It may be rude for me, but I would like to say greetings first thing in the morning. Good morning. I look forward to working with you all today. Ibuki. Yes, I am Ibuki Miyota. Aren't you acting strange too? Wait. Be careful, Ibuki. Hajime is dangerous. He wants to kill you and eat you. What are you saying? Yes. Mr. Hajime, I'm not tasty. Please don't eat me. He's obviously lying. I see. So it was a lie. It's the truth. It's not a lie. I never tell lies. Understood. I see. So it's not a lie. It may be necessary for me to beg for my life after all. What the hell is this? Akane, Nagato, Ibuki. They're all acting strange. What's going on? Um. Did they go crazy or something? It would be strange to go crazy in a situation like this. You got it wrong. That's not it. Yes. Ibuki, she has an extremely high fever. It's probably because. That's weird. Before you start talking, I want to tell you something. Who the hell are you? You forgotten me? I'm Mikan Sumiki. <laughs> Anyways, please please try touching her forehead. If you don't, uh, if you do, you'll see what I mean. My hand, I put my hand to her forehead. Ibuki, just a second. In exchange, please spare my life. I softly placed my head onto Ibuki's forehead. My head. My hand onto Ibuki's forehead while she was continuing to spout gibberish. She, dude, she's hot, dude. dude. What is this? The heat's at normal, man. Homegirls in heat. That's right, she has a terribly high fever. Then could the others... Akane, let me feel your forehead too. <laughs> Place my hand onto Akane's forehead. She was, uh, while she was groaning and kept sobbing. Must be it. She had a fever too. There's no way normal human body temperature. Nagito, you too? <laughs> I don't have a fever. I feel extremely great today. Place my hand on his forehead once again and got the same results. What? All three of them have fevers? Then the reason those guys are saying such wacky shit is... Emergency. My goodness! Emergency. This is obviously bad. Monokuma. For him to appear right now, does that mean this... 
Whoa there! Can you wait just a second for the explanation? The others are on their way too. And just as Monokuma said, I heard the sound of pounding footsteps. Everyone gathered had a confused expression plastered on their face. What's going on? Now what? Hey, hey. I heard from Monokuma, it looks like something strange is going on. Could it be? Uh, did something happen to you guys? Looks like everyone's here. Now then, let's start with the explanation. Wait. Hold on! Monokuma, you're pulling pranks again, aren't you? And what happens to Nakamura? Hurry up and return him first, you robber bear. Hmm? Nakamura, are you talking about the boy who turned into a woman when he gets slashed with the water? Wait, what? What the fuck are you talking to me about? You who the heck is that? Nakamura doesn't even have weird abilities like that. Jeez, shut up! Ah! I don't even know what's been done to me, but I feel a mysterious life energy. Well now. Now that I shut up the nuisance, let's get back to the topic at hand. Though. I'm pretty sure you guys have already noticed since you're all quick-witted. So it's just as I thought, the true identity of the high fever is... That's right! That's right. This is a new motive that I was given. What? Really? This is the motive? It's the despair disease! What the- Despair disease? Actually- You know, they're extremely tiny insects that can be seen in the neck eye. Well, that can't be seen with the neck eye. Living on this island. It's, it's not like I added them recently. I just never told you about them. Anyways, the endemic disease spread by these insects is called the despair disease. <laughs> despair disease? I never heard about such a thing. Well? Then let me tell you about it. As the name suggests... I'm sorry, I had like a little hiccup there. As the name suggests, the despair disease is a really annoying disease where you get high fever along with various symptoms that's full of despair. Those symptoms are different based on the person. For instance, Nagito is affected by the liar disease. Akane is affected by the coward disease. Ibuki has the gullible disease. What? Uh, they just had to get symptoms that were opposite of their normal personalities, except for Nagito. Hey, um... it's not like you all guys are down with the sickness yet. Be careful. Sometimes the spare disease can get passed from person to person, just like a cold. Huh? What? Do you mean it's contagious? <laughs> Don't put your guard down. Just because you don't have the disease, it'd be awful if everyone got sick. Hey, 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 hey. Let's run, Miss Sonya. It'd be terrible if you get caught, uh, if you caught the lowly disease of common folk. <laughs> That's right. Let's run away. I don't want to catch some weird disease. Why? Uh, why is that the motive? Are you saying that a killing will occur soon after everyone falls into a crazy state? <laughs> uh, isn't that quite a novel idea? A killing that occurs while everyone has completely different personalities? Think of all the murder tricks. Is there any way to treat it? Why? Why is there a need to treat it? I mean, this despair disease isn't supposed to make you suffer. It's a disease that cures your softened hearts, your soft hearts towards killing. And with this, you can finally take the plunge and commit murder. You, D you bastard. You better stop talking about this bullshit. <laughs> It's all my fault, I'm sorry. I'm always bothering you. All right. I've decided as an apology, I'm gonna commit murder. As there is- <laughs> What the fuck? I'm gonna commit murder. Are there any charcoal banquets any- Uh, banquets. B -b 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 -b. Yeah, uh, I'm pretty sure I found some that's it. Why are you telling him this? Stop it, Kane Nagito Ibuki. You guys stay out of this. Hey. You're wrong, I'm not Nagito. Tell you the truth, Nagito Komaeda is a fake name. I'm sorry, I've kept it a secret till now. Understood. Oh, I see. What the? She's believing him again? So serious. Amazing. Man, whatever. I feel so great today. This despair disease is awesome. Despair, 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 despair. It's amazing. You all should get it too. We're all done for. There's no such thing as hope. We all have to die from the despair disease. Th that's the. Uh, only way. Thump. <laughs> wow, he collapsed. <laughs> Nagito. Uh, and I've given you a new motive. How will things develop? Would the killing start after everyone gets the despair disease, or even before that? Thrills, chills, I'm so excited chills. about it. I'm just gonna stand around naked. Bring it on. Just kidding. I'm always naked. <laughs> hey. Damn it. Nekomaru's incident just happened and now this shit? Where did the peaceful mood that lasted till yesterday go? That lasted? Lasted? What the hell's wrong with me? That lasted. 
This is bad. Nagato's foaming from the ma <laughs> He's on the ground season? Really? He's like <laughs> She's right. I've never seen I never even seen foam that color before. Impossible! It, uh, well you guys are be careful around him, it's contagious now. It's an emperor of what the fuck? M M Hem what the fuck is that word? Oh, it's a rare color, normally only found found in the depths of Netherworld Sea. In that case, the color doesn't matter. So let's just head over to the hospital. Got it. Please wait. Uh, what what do we do about Kane and Ibuki? Anyway, uh, we're definitely gonna bring them too. We don't have what they do if we leave them alone. Wait, what? Oh, wait. We don't know what they'll do if we leave them alone. Okay, yeah. Hey, bastard. Can you walk? Yes. Allow me to confirm. I just had an alternate. I just had the alternate the mo the movement of my left and right fuck, what is wrong with me? Why can't I read? I just have to alternate the movements of my left and right leg, correct? <laughs> oh, hold on. I uh, I'll walk so don't leave me. Then let's go. With the disease in tow and Nagito, who whose condition was clearly worsening. <laughs> yeah, that's actually hilarious. I feel perfectly fine and then he just collapsed. We rushed over to the hospital. But this kind of motive is impossible. And actual despair disease? And there are possibility that it might be passed along. What the hell? Damn it. Should I do? Make sure you wash your hands. I'll go make the infected change their clothes. And then I'll have them sleep in the patient's room. Understood. Understood. So I just have to change my clothes, correct? I'm scared of changing. Anyways, everyone else, please wait here. Uh, as she supported all three of them with her shoulders, Mekon disappeared into the depths of the hospital. Damn it! Damn, I never expected us to get sick. What's gonna happen? Let me tell you. I I would not mind if Nagito retired permanently. Maybe. Is Mekon gonna personally change her clothes? What's wrong with that? Well. Does that include Nagito too? Isn't that a little bad? <laughs> uh, there's no need to panic. Even I attended to the need by my four dark days of destruction. Hey, hey, hey. Don't lump hamsters and teenage boys together. Uh, hey, is this stupid conversation going to last much longer? Hey. Shouldn't we be seriously thinking about what we need to do from now? What we need to do from now on? Hmm. Uh, who would I talk to here? What? What is the point of talking? Sonia? Um. I'm worried about those three, but there's a chance that Minikon will catch it while tending to them. Oh. Oh, no. Please, God. Oh, no. <laughs> Mekon, please don't die. Jeez! Uh, that disease such... Uh, that disease sir sure looks dangerous. Nagito, Kane, and Ibuki aren't acting normal. If it spreads to anyone else, a killing is bound to happen. Let me tell you this. Based on their observed behavior, I cannot deny that. But, but those guys are being considerate. I want them to at least have the uh, decency to consider committing suicide before they start bothering us. That is. Hey, Hayako. <laughs> I know it can't be that easy. So it's important to make sure we don't end up capturing the disease. Make sure. What do you mean? Jeez, why don't you get it? We need to isolate them from us so they won't spread the disease. Uh, isolate? If you can't cure it, the only option is to stop it from spreading. Even a preschooler knows that. But still, isn't isolating them a bit too harsh? Hey, if everyone catches the spare disease, we won't be able to do anything about it anymore, you know? You're right. There's no way we could allow it to spread. Hold on a second. Hey, hey. Isolation. You mean we need to quarantine them inside the hospital, right? Cheeky, don't tell me you also agree. Okay, Hajime, what the fuck is wrong with isolating them? That's not a bad thing. You can still come and visit them. Just put them in an isolation room. Speak through the glass. That's wrong. It's not to. Uh, it's to prevent. Oh, uh, fuck. It's. Fuck, I can't. What is wrong with me? It's to prevent a killing. As long as the disease is Monokuma's motive, we just need to ignore it. Uh, if we just just need to ignore it. why the hell did I say that? If we just ignore it, a killing will happen. To prevent that, we also have to prevent the disease from spreading. That's why we need to quarantine them. Like... Even if we quarantine them, who's going to take care of them? <laughs> Mekon's going to stay here anyways. 
She's been touching the infected all over her, so it's possible she's already caught the disease. But there's no way we can leave her by herself. Hey. Then why don't you stay too, huh? 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 Now then, that's, uh, now that I think about it, you touch them when you took their temperatures, right? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> so, I'll leave the rest of you. Contact me if something happens. Contact you? How are we supposed to do that? Jeez. All right, we need to think of a way to communicate. If we keep make if we keep meeting in person, we catch disease. Thank you. So I'll let you handle that, Kazuchi. Uh, yeah, I got it. Front knot. We were not going to abandon you. I shall station myself nearby in case anything happens. Nearby? There's a motel on the island. Until this matter is resolved, we shall stay in the night there. Aww. What? You really have to stay in such a dirty place? Silence. What are you supposed to do if we can't immediately get here if something happens? Also, if the disease is airborne, the hotel on the first island might already be in few, uh, unsafe. This is the Tanaka Empire! We must be vigilant about protection. I have those who must be protected. You. They're, they're just hamsters, man. I'll destroy That's an unkind you. thing to say, you fiend. How dare you call my four dark days of destruction hamsters. Jeez! Fine, I'll just stay at the motel, okay? Jeez, how annoying. <laughs> Even if it's quarantine, we're just gonna be on the same island, so just call us if anything happens. Tuh. What What are you frustrated for? I don't like this. this is obviously a trap. Monaco's goal is to separate us as a group. Is it really okay for us to fall for that? So... It's not like we stop being friends. We just don't want to kill to happen ever again. We can't prevent that if everyone got sick, you know. You know, right? Yeah, that's right, man. There's no way we're gonna lose together here, you know? That's right! Because if that happens, then Monokuma gets what he wants. Hey, Hayako. What did you say to me earlier? Something about me being the first one to get cut off? And? What's wrong with that? Huh. This is... This, uh, this must be the moment. It's not like me, and Hajime are enough people. You! Are you saying you're gonna stay here, too? Huh? You too? Uh, this life of mine is spare anyway. Fine then, do whatever you want. Hey, Fihiko, are you sure? You might be endangering yourself, you know. Jeez. Hey, don't make me repeat myself. Hey, hey. You really, really okay with this? Then I'm gonna leave the rest to you. Whatever happens over here, just leave it to us. Make sure we keep the disease from spreading. Come on, shouldn't you guys head over to the motel before you catch the disease? I am sorry. I'm sorry for forcing this upon you like this. No, what everyone's saying is true, so it's okay. Thanks. Thank you both. I will let your feelings go to waste. We'll make sure to find out the mystery of the despair disease while you're all here. I think, probably. I really prefer if she had more confidence sounding catchphrase. Um. Now then, I shall execute. Uh, <laughs> I shall execute myself. No, I shall excuse myself. I'm counting on you. <laughs> then I'll make sure to figure some way to communicate later. Bye. Bye. Do your best and try to stay alive. And just like that, the others left. Leave me for you go at the hospital. I never expected it would turn out like this. Jeez. Uh, it's not like it's their fault. It's that bastard Monokuma's fault. I can't believe he actually arranged something as irritating as a disease. Hello. Thanks for waiting. <laughs> Phew, we finally finished changing. Everyone's resting in their rooms. Huh? Why is it just you two? Huh? Uh, you know... Oh, I know. They must have left to get fruits to bring back later. Everyone's so kind. I'm just glad everyone is so thankful towards their friends. Well, like I said... Oh, we're all equals when we're sick. Let's all work together and do our very best. Hajime, I'm sorry, but I'll let you handle the explanation. It's quite the burden I have to bear. And so we decided to split into two groups. And oh, what? Did I skip something? My bad. Uh, split into two group. In the hospital, there. Are, okay, yeah. In the hospital, there are three people who call it Monokuma's disease: Akane, Nagato, and Ibuki. There's also Mikan, who's nursing them back to health. And as a safeguard for Yuhiko and myself, all together, six people are staying at the hospital. Isn't Nakamura in here too? Chiki, Gundam, Kazuchi, Sonya, and Hayako are staying at the motel on the same island. As for Nakamaru, he's not back yet, but... Anyways, until we do something about the despair disease, our current situation isn't going to change. But, we have no clue what we need to do. Seriously, what should we do? 